So it's five o'clock, right? And I'm just getting home and I'm thinking, okay, I've totally got this whole week four thing figured out. I'm so excited. It brings together ideas I've seen and I, 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 I was so excited to launch it. So I open Twitter and I click on the Rizo 15 hashtag. And what do I see? Oh, Dave, sorry, you're not in charge of Rizo 15 anymore. Um, because my good friend Viplav Boxy from India um, who was an original CCK waiter? I've known him for years. We've worked together. Really solid, smart dude. Says, you know what? Dave must be getting tired out there doing all this thinking about the course and stuff. We're going to help him out. And if this is all collaborative and the community is the curriculum, then why can't we have our own topics? Well, fair enough. And I'm not letting go the idea I had for this week because we're going to do that one next week. I don't care what you say, but fair enough. And his question's an interesting one. So, I mean, I can't let it go. So, Viplov asks us, how do we get rid of the idea of Dave? Should we get rid of the idea of Dave? So, digging into that a little bit, and Viplov's talking about online learning generally, but let's talk about practical, formal learning more specifically. How do you teach rhizomatically? What does it mean to be a teacher when we're talking about learning subjectives and content as people and you know we're, we're trying to push uncertainty rather than certainty and therefore we can't measure any of this learning business? What does it mean to teach? What does it mean to be the person who hosts the event? Call it what you will, but at some point, someone, some group, some idea is starting a thing. I mean, the whole difference between a course and the internet is the structure. And I'm interested in, you call them open courses or MOOCs, or I still think of them as courses. And I think of them as courses because I'm inviting you all to a party that's going to last a certain period of time. You know you're invested for that period of time. You know what you're coming to the party for. What you do at the party is totally up to you. But maybe I'm throwing out some parlor games and maybe I've put out a couple of drinks for people to, to sort of sample on their way. But what is my role as party host? What's a teacher in the rhizome? Dig in, take a look, folks, and I look forward to seeing what you come up with. Cheers.